Once again, welcome to our channel. Today I'm super excited. <laughs> Finally, I'm back with the Mokua. Eh? Mokua Times. Mokua Hello, Times. how are you doing? Thank you so much. Mokua. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. uh, si sana. Uh. The impeachment is busy now. Uh -huh. uh -huh. So you're back. <laughs> you're back. You're back. Anyway. Uh, Tim Ciprin, Tim Mokua, and Tim Morara are uh, Karibuni Sana. And today we just want to discuss about something in Morara at Kwame and Kapo Jana. Mm -hmm. Office Nimeona Mileta mixed reactions. Yes, yes. Uh, he wrote in his Facebook account, mm -hmm. I finally realized who I am. Mm -hmm. From today, you will see a difference. Mm -hmm. And now today, uh, I just wrote the same message, kind of similar message, mm -hmm. where you think of, your, of yourself in a small way you will behave small. Talk small and do small. Now I know who I am. So people are asking, who is he? Mm -hmm. Wakati anasema, now I know who I am. Mm -hmm. So who have, tumekua tukidiri na mtumgani, na sasa ni mtumgani ambaye anaongea. So this thing, it may create so many reactions ambapo, ata mi mwenye siji what to concrete. No, What's ma. your take? Me what I can say is this, eh? mm -hmm. first of all, Marara came to a certain space that's so huge. <coughs> Uh, when I see, see these kind of texts that he's putting online, I sometimes feel like uh, probably did not assess himself well before he got into the game. But the fact remains, we believe he's, okay, he's, he's, we believe he's capable. Mm -hmm. I get in this. So, once we believe that he's capable, he should shape himself to fit the expectations that we have as the people who follow or even support him. I get in that. So, right now as we speak, Maria Kebaso is maybe sitting down trying to assess himself because he has actually has experienced some few things, three of them, that are scary to him. One of them, Nilia Kupigwa, another one, Nilia Kushikwa, and Akushikwa Tena. Mm -hmm. You get mm -hmm. such kind of occurrences, probably they can change his thinking because Akwa Meshikwa before. Akwa Mehacho before. So basically, Lazima Mindy can change. Mm -hmm. One thing Kenyans have to remember that Maria is just 28 years old. Despite of what he has done, there are some experience that he needs to have. There are some years he needs to live to think in a certain way and to do things in a certain manner. So as we speak right now, probably one thing you need to do is to avoid thinking loud. I get in this. Mm -hmm. Because he can create some doubts in us which are not necessary. If he thinks and makes the decisions by himself, he will enjoy seeing the fruits because eventually we know that he's going to make the right decisions. Mm -hmm. So therefore, what I can just tell him is simple. Right now, where he is right now, that's something he has to know. And any slight break. Murara can post today he wants to keep quiet and relax and have a break. Then he gets arrested. Mm -hmm. No, we will know that he's in a break or he's arrested. Nobody. Nobody. So he needs to be very careful when it comes to putting anything public as far as he's concerned. But I feel right now, because you know the team he had assembled before, mm -hmm. it was not a complete team in terms of the advice and strategy and the politics as far as it's concerned in Kenya. So I think he, what he was just maybe supposed to do is to align his group, know the people he's having and know that this is what they're going to do and these are their roles. And then he moves as an opposition team of the youths now. Because I personally thought, when he was moving around about the Vampire Diaries, there's something else he could have done. I get in this. Mm -hmm. He didn't do it in the entire time that he was there. And actually that can also tell some of the things that have not happened according to his expectations. So in short, I think he needs to align himself now, but he should avoid thinking loud. I get in that. Sit himself down, have a strategy, discuss with his family, now come out to us. The moment he comes to politics, he has to somehow know that the family will not have him the same person again. He will not be the same. Maybe I got a part of Morara, wake up every night, every morning, hi baby, he's a different person. The moment, it's a different thing anymore. Because he's getting to a space that requires a lot of commitment, a lot of precautions, and a lot of also planning of activities. Mm -hmm. I get in this. <coughs> now, he started a party. Beginning a party, it's not time for you to tell us we have a break. So it is time for him to strategize on how the party is moving forward. Even if he sits now today, stays for one month without talking, then crafts that team, that team comes on board, there will be still some loopholes. Okay? Despite of sitting down, being very keen, smart, still there will be loopholes. So the only advantage he needs to have right now is to know that he has the support of Kenyans. All these other things that are coming in the way, being arrested, being beaten, these are political terrain of Kenya. Mm -hmm. of, course, of course, you don't wish that he gets beaten, sure. but it's the Kenyan terrain of politics. Mm -hmm. in a rough as such. It's only that in, as he moves forward, 
he learns, corrects, strategizes. But this also doesn't happen simultaneously. Akiendelea kusonga, anaendelea kustrategize, anaendelea kujipanga vila anaenda. So basically that's what politics of Kenya entails. However, I just want to say that there are so many things that he has not done mm -hmm. as far as his solidification of his support is concerned. Mm -hmm. At Jonah support yaki kikuwa defined vizuri. Agenda yaki jatokia clear. Even the injected party is yet to be believed by people in Kenya. And actually even the youth, not even 20% are supporting him in Kenya. So he needs to consolidate himself. Also, I want to say that he has been on social media, particularly an ex, holding meetings there. Those ex people, you should forget about them as for now. Those people, they are social media people. Yes, they can speak some of the things, but most of the ex people don't come to the ground. Are you getting that? And most of the ex people can easily be compromised. So it's not because they are doing things as an individual person. So Morara must now think of politics the way every other politician in Kenya thinks about it. The aggressiveness, the dirty games that exist, the seriousness that is there. That's my fear. If he's genuinely wanting to become a leader in this country. Mm -hmm. But come attacky, assignment, what I say, I'm going for breaks or what? Assignment, yeah, he gets to the Kuba Kwa, Kwang, assignment, separate, you can be by, you can actually inject part. Even to raise. Now, Mukua, uh, let's talk about this thing called arranging his house. Mm -hmm. The other day we saw uh, Kisama Kwamba, there is a mall mm -hmm. in between the clue. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, he came outside there saying like, oh, Nimiona Mall, Nimiona this. But the Kenyan people, the way they reacted, mm -hmm. it was kind of like he wasn't supposed to come and uh, say like Ikuna Mall without mm -hmm. telling us who the mall is. Yes, yes. Now, there was some people like Maverick Ahoko, mm -hmm. alisema kuna jamaflani alikuwa so close na Morara, anaitua KOT, mm -hmm. yeye ndi alikuwa mall. Mm -hmm. And days later, mm -hmm. Uh, Morara just uh, replied to someone called Aniva mm. saying like uh, Kyoti is not a mall mm. of which Kyoti has been trod for some days mm -hmm. and the other day we were alive for Kisema Kwamba mm. the time when we were alive bombers of Kenya mm -hmm. we complained why Kasmuel never stood with mm -hmm. Morara mm -hmm. but why Morara never stood with Kyoti wakati alikuwa mm -hmm. alikuwa trolled akakuja kusema days after mm -hmm. alikuwa trolled mm -hmm. now my question ni mm -hmm. do you think mm -hmm. Morara ali aliarakisha mm -hmm. ku choose people kuwaweka in that injective party without knowing them mm -hmm. deep who is more who is Cyprin we smokuwa mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. vitu zenye amekuwa akifanya mm -hmm. so unaona hizo vitu ni kama zime distract ama what do you think because people have been complaining like oh you don't have to come public kutulilia kutuambia mm -hmm. those are the things you should handle by yourself mm -hmm. and you are group in between so what's your take i agree those people are telling me should not come public <coughs> to cry mm -hmm. the things that are done publicly is not to deal nazo kama public but is a private na paswa ku deal nazo private privately but definitely akikuja in public lazima confirm kitu na tujue kama sisi wenyewe kama ni mtu fulani ambaye Troy is no longer with us with us but what I want to say that uh, Morara has not portrayed leadership all through when it comes to the Gen Z protest him now coming on board he has not put himself in a certain position you can say indeed there is leadership in this kind of a corner I once attended his uh, his twitter his ex platform where he was being asked questions most people are complaining he talks too much. Others were saying, yeah, there are things that are not clear. He's doing by himself. Are you getting this? He noted them down and he recognized such kind of weaknesses. And I told myself, he's in the move. Autumn correct, better. Which is okay. But we have to remember that Murara, one thing he has done is the exposure of the Vampa Diaries. He's yet to lead a team. Because when it comes to those people who came together with him, he did not offer, he did not offer structure on how these people are coming on board. They just, it's like I wake up in the morning, I say I want to be the Morara, I know him to Kuevo. So no, no. He did not even vet them. I told you there are some people I saw in other platforms with Jim Wanjigi, with other people somewhere else, and they are still with Morara. Then you question yourself, what is the agenda of such kind of a person? So it is very clear as we speak right now, Morara has not before, has even not organized his house. I'm not even sure whether these people who are with him are even with him at, when it comes to the sincerity of the things on the ground. So the fact remains that, if he has opted now to organize his team, he has to give a structure on how things are going to happen. It is not only the team that is having, even the inject part itself. I saw him say, this is your party, come in, if you want to be a party leader, just come. That is not leadership. If you leave this thing a free ground for everyone, Ruto will pay you guys and they will come openly and even take over the party. I'm mm -hmm. telling you that. Mm -hmm. So you must offer some leadership as a leader. You must guide people on how things are done until when you are out. Are you seeing this? Mm -hmm. So Morel is here to bring that out mm -hmm. because every time he's telling this and that, he's saying that in the end, yes. So long as he's given that 
position, that dedication of being the leader, you must take the leadership roles. So he has to stop being a free man when it comes to saying things and also executing things. Mm -hmm. He has to offer leadership. Come in the morning and tell us, as from next week tomorrow, you have the registration of what? Inject party members across the country. Towards the register, come to register. So that we all feel something that we are missing, the leadership. Right now, as we speak, the people who are older than the Gen Z's and millennials are willing to support Morara, but is yet to come out different than Kakina Kasmuel. I get in this. Let me give you an example here. Kasmuel and his team, Masida Ruz and the rest, they were killed by one simple thing, a question. What next after William Ruto has done what? Has, has gone. Resigned, maybe. I get in this. Mm -hmm. Do you know what they say? No, don't say about yes, what next? First of all, let him go. Someone somewhere who is willing to support it in this country, was willing to see what's the creativity, what's the smartness, what's the wisdom, and what's the plan of these people. But they failed to, push, to show that, isn't it? Murara is probably going to the same side. I saw it on the last show that he had with, uh, on Spice FM, and I felt like, okay, Murara is being outshined now on social media. I even felt like someone could have told him it's time to exit interviews and execute, so that when I call you for an interview, it's not to me to interview you what I want. But it's what I have done. You get. So Murara went in there in, on Space FM. At the end of the interview, was shown that he's not smart. And I don't think that he, he took time to listen or see what happened. It was time he had just been beaten. He was actually not okay. He had a stiff neck. And then he was asked some few questions about the Gadi Gashawa impeachment. He contradicted himself so much to an extent, even said, William Ruto is better than who? Gashawa. Yet we all know that William Ruto is the worst. Gashawa will go, but William Ruto is the worst of all. So in this sense, I want to say that uh, Morari is a young man, and of course, he needs some guidance and a good team to work with him. But where he had put himself, he cannot come out. It's only that he puts his mind and the right people around him, mm -hmm. and he consults, reaching out to some various people who are right, like-minded. Uh, there are people who have been supporting him. He can even go to the family members for guidance, because it's a family that has been having politicians. They can guide him on how to make steps here and there. Mm -hmm. And then there are several <coughs> things that we need to do as a country, as a leader, defining your base. He has left completely the youths separate. He's doing things generally, just like Alonso, just like Garuto. I have a vijana kando. So get it down. But I have a campaign for a vijana pamu. So there's a lot you need to do. I'll personally create time, go visit him. If we get time to share an one-on-one, -on -one, to when I come and there are things, few things we can share. Mm -hmm. But I think he's growing. We need, despite of his mistakes that he can make, he needs a 100% support. So that at least come of youths in this country can have a voice at some point. Wow, mm. that's amazing. So I don't know, guys, what's your take about the advice being given by Mokwa Times. Maybe in the comment section, what's your suggestion? Anyway, to Team Cyprian, to Team Mokwa Times, thank you so much. See you in our next video.